Alright, so today I'm going to show you guys how to stream on OBS with the crappiest of CPUs at 720p and 29.97 frames per second. So the computer I stream from has the worst processor in it. It is the Intel Celeron CPU J3060, 1.6 gigahertz, two cores, two logical processors in it, which is 1 11th the processing power of the Intel Core i7, 4790K at four gigahertz. It clocks at about 959, whereas the Intel i7 is 11,191. So that should give you a pretty general idea of how crappy the CPU I'm running is. On top of that, I have about 3.5 gigabytes of RAM, which is almost as crappy as to come. So with that being said, let's get started. All right, so the first thing you can do to save about 10% of your CPU um, is where your um, preview is. Turn that off. It saves about 10% of your CPU when you're streaming. And then the next thing you're going to do is you're going to go to your settings. You're going to come over to the output tab. I run mine on simple. Some people do advanced, but I prefer simple myself. Um, 1600 on your video buy trait is about what I run. Hardware. And then over on the audio buy trait, I just put that at 128. Right here where it says enable advanced encoder settings, make sure you turn that on. Um, you want to change it to speed and then you're going to want to go to your video tab make sure that's in 720p on the output scale that's what it's going to send out this uh, base one is just what's right here um, so it doesn't really matter what that is but I do keep mine at 720 so when I'm scaling everything it makes sense um, I'm going to see what's going out you want to do 32 samples on the um, downscale filter and the frames per second you can run at 30 but I do the 29.97 um, and in the advanced tab where it says process priority, change that to high. That right there is probably the most important thing you can do. And then you're going to want to save your settings. And then what you're also going to want to do is open up task manager. You're going to want to, um, yours is going to start out looking like this, hit more details. Go to details when you right click right click again on OBS and you're gonna set that priority to high or above normal I do high but um, if you have got a slightly better CPU than me you can do above normal but whatever you do uh, I don't even recommend this on the best CPUs do not hit real time okay just change it to high real time could possibly break your PC you're gonna get this warning here that says um, my, may cause system instability that system instability will 100 percent happen on real time um, but I do high and as you can see CPU is just fine um, and that's all you really need to do to run a decent stream at 720p 29.97 frames per second I don't drop frames with this um, thank you for watching I just want to thank everybody who tuned in to watch this video I know I made one that was sort of similar before but this one went slightly more in depth on how to uh, stream through OBS and if you like what you see make sure you hit that subscribe button Make sure that you give me ideas in the comment section about future videos and what you thought about this video. And if you want, you can give this video a thumbs up. And I want to apologize for that really annoying clicking noise that you guys heard through about three quarters of the video. It was not intended, but I had already recorded the video and then I went to watch it and realized that it had that noise. So I want to apologize and thank you for watching.